for Celebrity Fan Out, the Flashback Friday edition. No, we have some good ones. Rajini writes, hey, Wendy, how you doing? <laughs> About a year before she blew up, I met Lady Gaga. I got to meet her at a little club in New York City after, a, after her performance. I could tell back then that she would be a huge star someday. Wow. And Lana writes, hey, Wendy, I was at Fashion Week back in the day <laughs> when I was sitting next to Kim Kardashian. <laughs> If she was going for the exotic look with all the, the, the face stuff and everything, she should have just kept it the way it was. Yes. Beautiful, right? Yes. Eh. Anyway, so she said, I had no idea that soon after this picture, Ray J would make her famous, <laughs> LOL. <laughs> and Sonia writes, hi, Wendy, how you doing? <laughs> In the early 90s, I was waiting in the lobby of a hotel, wait, waiting in the lobby of a concert venue when someone approached me and told me the artist wanted to meet me. <laughs> and the artist was Ice Cube. <laughs> I mean, this looks like so many girls in the early 90s. It could be me, it could be my cousin Debbie. You know, it's you, Sonia. But listen to what Cube said. By the way, he hasn't aged a, a bit, has he? Ice Cube asked me if I would give him a ride back to his hotel. Being the cool girl that I am, I politely told him no. Sometimes I wonder if I would have ended up being Mrs. Cube had I taken him up on his offer. That's cute. And Steven writes, hey, Wendy, how you doing? <laughs> a few years back, I purchased backstage passes to a concert to meet Beyonce. <laughs> so Steven says, at the time, her father, Matthew, was still her manager. And when I said hello, he shook my hand very forcefully. <laughs> LOL. Beyonce was lovely in all white and smelled amazing. It was the best night of my life. She looks terrific, and so do you. Thank you so much, Steven. Tracy writes, hi, Wendy, how you doing? I was at the airport when I met Ludacris. I was struggling to take a pic, and Luda said, um, you might want to turn your camera around. I was so nervous that the camera was facing the wrong way. By the way, if you want to know what he wanted on his rider, you know that list of celebrity demands? Creamy peanut butter and Magnum condoms. Yeah. <laughs> it sounds about right. <laughs> Patricia writes, I had a run in, uh, excuse me, I had to run out uh, for last minute Thanksgiving ingredients when I ran in... <laughs> into Dionne Warwick. <laughs> okay. Says... I was in such a rush to get to the store that I was in my pajamas, didn't even br <laughs> brush my teeth. So I was totally unprepared to say, hello. <laughs> but I'm glad I did, even if I did look a hot mess. Uh, Leanne writes, uh, hey, Wendy, how you doing? I was on Rodeo Drive. When I ran into Chris Brown. Wow. Ooh. Okay. She says, I asked him for a pic, and he was so nice about it, he even called me babe. Okay, Leanne, though, and then what had happened? Because you all look really cute together. Thank you, I love that one. Steven uh, writes, hey, Wendy, I was walking to work when I ran into Iggy Azalea. What? Yeah, that's a good one. Um, she's the most humble lady I've ever met. Don't we like, uh, don't we look like best friends in the picture? Yeah, yes, yes, you do. You look like the needy one, I might add. <laughs> Uh, no, you're very cute, uh, Stephen. You look a little bit like the very dysfunctional Chris Brown. Yeah. Yes, you do. Johnny writes, I was at the Abbey. Oh, we love the Abbey. <laughs> I was at the Abbey. It's a gay club in L.A. Um, 
Anyway, I was at the Abbey when I ran into Jussie Smollett. <laughs> now... Now he says, he says, Janet Jackson's If came on, and I started doing the choreography and noticed someone next to me doing the same thing. I was shocked when I turned and noticed that it was Jussie, and he turned to me and said, yes, you better work. Yes. And Angela writes, hey, Wendy, how you doing? I was at a basketball game when I ran into Drake. <laughs> He smelled so good, Wendy. Look at my face. Doesn't it look like I'm having a Drake-gasm? <laughs> Funny. Savannah writes, hey, Wendy, how you doing? I was visiting friends um, at work when I unexpectedly ran into Dwayne The Rock Johnson. <laughs> yeah. The thing is, Savannah, a broken arm always gets sympathy. <laughs> and good for you. She goes... His body and muscles in person are amazing. Can you say best day ever? <laughs> and Samantha says, how you doing, Wendy? I was walking down 59th Street in New York and saw Naomi Campbell. At first, she said she didn't have time to take the picture with me, but right before she got into her limo, she turned around and says, I've got a minute. Let's take the picture. That's a good one. Naomi Campbell so much and every time I see her out socially she always says I'm such a big fan I watched the show and Shana writes hey Wendy I was at the airport when I saw Joe Manganiello <laughs> wow she says my friend spotted him but I had no idea who he was <laughs> see this is the kind of fan out that pisses me off like, you just want to take a picture just because everybody else is fanning out. You, you know what I mean? Like, as soon as you see somebody's mouth say, that's the talk. <laughs> well, he's nice then. All right, so she says, um, I had no, I, I have no idea. All right, wait. I had no idea who he was, so I went up to him and said, I have no idea who you are, <laughs> but my friend says that we have to take a pic. Thank you, Shana. And Dana writes, Hi, Wendy. How you doing? How you doing? I was at a store waiting for the elevator when I saw Stevie Wonder. <laughs> okay. She says, I was looking at his dreads like, dang. <laughs> They're so tiny and super long. When I asked him for a pic, he told me to smile and say cheese. LOL, he was super nice. Aww. Oh. Mm-mm, I won't go there. Let's move on. <laughs> and Emily writes, hey, Wendy, how you doing? <laughs> I was at the pool in Vegas when I saw Britney Spears. <laughs> Can you imagine? Because I'm, I'm sure Britney has a private pool at her suite while she does her residency, but she came down and socialized. She goes, I was completely shocked and couldn't stop shaking and crying because I'm such a huge fan. She gave me a big hug and told me everything's going to be okay. Aww. Oh, wow. And Ebony writes, hey, Wendy, I was shopping at the mall when I ran into Sierra. <laughs> That's good. Beautiful. She says, she was doing a meet and greet and we took several selfies together. She's so gorgeous and I will never forget that day. I love me some Cece. Aww. Ebony, I hope you didn't ask her about future. <laughs> and Sylvia writes, hey, Wendy, how you doing? I was at a concert in London when I met Adele. Now, these were all so good today. Look, so, she goes, she came up to me in between songs. I told her that I traveled all the way from New Jersey to see her. <laughs> she was so appreciative. She told me to take the photo. It was the best night of my life. I love celebrity fan out. Okay, this is very random. Listen closely. <laughs> Tracy says, hey, Wendy, my son was walking down the street when he ran into Denzel Washington. <laughs> Now, imagine that. 
Like you're in Pittsburgh, you're in your neighborhood, and you're walking and you run into Denzel. I would have kept moving. I would have thought an optical illusion, just rubbed my eyes and kept going. Anyway, so my son, uh, uh, wait, my son was too cool to fan out. <laughs> So I quickly called my husband, who ran out into the cold to take this picture with Denzel. Ryan writes, hey, Wendy, I was working out at the gym when I saw Common. Oh. Who you know is from Chicago. Ryan says, I'm a trainer, and I noticed that his form was off. So I went over and offered some advice. He was really receptive and we ended up pumping some iron together. And Ren writes, I was on vacation in Capri, Italy. Oh, darling. When I met Mariah Carey. <laughs> Ren says, she was with James Packard at the time and when I told Mariah that she was awesome, James replied, yes, she is. <laughs> Tamisha writes, I was driving around Hollywood with my girlfriends when, when I met The Weeknd. <laughs> she says, we spotted him in his car, waved, and he pulled over and took this pic with me in an alley. <laughs> nice. If he's the one who pulled over, then why is he the one that looks pissed? <laughs> and you look cute, by the way, Tamisha. And Teresa writes, I went to see Cinderella on Broadway when I got to meet Sherry Shepard and Kiki Palmer. <laughs> nice! She says, they greeted me like we were old friends. It was such a great day. And Umaru writes, hey, Wendy, how you doing? <laughs> I was at a Grammy party. How fabulous is the audience? <laughs> Grammy partying. <laughs> when I met Rihanna. <laughs> he says, I'm a driver and was asked to meet a client inside. Rihanna heard my accent and wanted to know all about me. She was so engaging, I could tell she has a good heart. Art. Nice. Sweet picture. Thank you. Thank you, Umari. Umaru. Oh, well, now, now, please. This one comes with um, instructions. <laughs> As in play video. It's hey Ray B. And he writes, I was at a concert when I was pulled on stage to meet Tony Braxton. <laughs> Roll the tape. So, I told her I was nervous. Uh, I, I told her I was nervous, uh, to which she replied, you don't have to be nervous, we're family. She was so beautiful, humble, and sweet, even though I screwed up her song. Maybe I should have left the high note back in the shower. And Alyssa writes, hey, Wendy, a random trip to the city led to a chance encounter with Miley Cyrus. Oh. How do you chance encounter that? Look, they're holding hands and everything. She told me I was pretty, which caught me off guard. It was the best thing that happened to me all year. Oh. Terrific. And Beatrice writes, hey, Wendy, how you doing? How you doing? <laughs> <laughs> I went to a concert many years ago and met Katy Perry. Oh. Beatrice says, this was before she was really famous. I knew then and there that she would be a huge star. Wow, what a throwback picture. Thanks, Beatrice. Yeah. Andrea writes, hey, Wendy, how you doing? How you doing? <laughs> <laughs> I was at the airport when I met Kanye West. Oh. oh. <laughs> she says, he was on the phone, but he stopped to take this pic. He was wearing a diamond and gold bottom grill. You're so observant. Thank you, Andrea. Yeah. And Allie writes, hey, Wendy, I was at the Aspen Food and Wine Festival when I met Pink. <laughs> turns out, um, it turns out Pink is a real foodie, which is why she was there. We kept running into her, and she was very cool every single time. I've never been to a wine festival. 
you know where they grow. I've never. I know I'd be big fun. I'd be big fun at a wine fest. <laughs> I've never been to one though. You know, maybe we need to make a road trip. You know. All right. And so Anthony writes, "Hey, Wendy, I heard via Twitter that my favorite rapper was in town, and I got to meet Nicki Minaj." <laughs> She was filming The Other Woman, so I waited outside her trailer with some other fans. She signed my album and then uh, bought everyone pizza. Oh, How nice. That's nice. He's got hair like Young Jock. <laughs> <laughs> Edward writes, hey, Wendy, how you doing? <laughs> when I arrived in Thailand, I love my fancy Wendy watchers. <laughs> For vacation, I was stunned to find out who was staying in my hotel, Angelina Jolie. Yeah. Right? Yeah. Look, no, the best part is he says, she graciously took the photo with me. I was so excited, I forgot to take the breathing strip off my face. Yeah. And Victor writes, hey, Wendy, how are you doing? I was at a karaoke bar in New York City when I met Lindsay Lohan. Okay, so look, so Victor goes, she heard me singing and invited me into a private room with her and her friends. She signed my arm, so I had it permanently tattooed. Aww. I mean, it's not just, the, the triangle is her, all the words are her. You are a fan, aren't you, Victor? <laughs> Cute. And Renia uh, says, hey, Wendy, I was in Miami, and who did I see pull up in a white Rolls Royce? Little Wayne. <laughs> She says, I immediately threw my drink down, pulled my heels off, and ran across the street barefoot with one of my girls to get this amazing shot. Okay. And um, Eric writes, hey, Wendy, how you doing? I was walking down the street and ran into Jennifer Lopez. Her security closed the door of her SUV when I approached, but I, but check out what happened when she saw the disappointment on my face. All right, let's take a look. If I could take one photo, please. If I could bother for one photo, please. Please, 10 years in the making, please. How you doing? God bless you. I love you. Thank you for everything. And Vinny writes, hey, Wendy, how you doing? I was at a concert when I met Lady Gaga. Yeah. Really? Yeah. Oh, wait, no. It gets bigger. He says, I was in the front row. She pulled me on stage and even got me singing Born This Way with her at the piano. He said it was the most memorable time of his life. Well, he looks young. He's got more life to live. And Vaughn writes, hey, Wendy, how you doing? I was working as an assistant on a photo shoot when I got to meet Beyonce. Oh. He says, I was asked to stop what I was doing so that the photographer could take some pictures and, and or, excuse me, practice photos, and Beyonce appeared out of nowhere and started posing with me. Oh. By the way, Vaughn and everybody, Beyonce's uh, formation tour kicks off tomorrow in Miami. Yeah. Which makes me all the more suspicious as to who's on the payroll. Is it Rita Ora? Is it Rachel Roy? Were these rumors planted so that we get to talking and buying tickets? Can't trust a big butt and a smile. <laughs> and Janet, write, Janet writes, hey, Wendy, I was at the airport when I got the nerve to approach Black China. She says, I told her that she was really pretty and she said, you are too, she was very sweet. By the way, Black China is not wasting time capitalizing on this thing. You know, yesterday she revealed her chai mojis. Did you see them? Oh yes, the chai, she's got like 700 of them. Good for you, China. Tear the kingdom down. Yeah. 
Our final celebrity fan out comes from Isaac C, who watches The Wendy Show on WNYW in Patterson, New Jersey. And Isaac writes, how you doing, Wendy? I was... <laughs> it's okay, you guys are so cute. <laughs> Um, I was backstage at the iHeart Music Awards and got a chance to meet Selena Gomez. <laughs> so look, so look, he goes, I tried to take a photo, but I ended up pressing the video button by mistake. So let's roll it and see this. <laughs> Lucky you. Well, I love celebrity fan outs. If you ever have a celebrity encounter and you want to share the story and you've got the proof, please uh, go to wendyshow.com and help a sister out, okay? Yeah.